Hey Doc. I'm having some issues with my ears and I thought I should come see you. You're having some problems with your ears, huh? Well, you definitely came to the right place. Tell me some of the problems you're having. Billy. Oh, sorry. What did you say? Could you tell me some of the problems you're having? Oh, yeah. I first started noticing something was wrong when my family and friends had to ask me all the time why I had the TV up so loud. I also realized that there are times when I completely miss what someone said. It happens especially when we are in certain public areas. Do you have any pain in your ear, Billy? Any pain in your ear? No, there isn't any pain, but every once in a while I get a constant ringing in my ears. What does all this mean, Doc? Well, Billy, from listening to your symptoms, it seems like you may be developing some hearing loss. Difficulty understanding speech by people, having to have volume turned up on the TV, and ringing in the ears are all strong symptoms of hearing loss. Hearing loss? How do I have hearing loss? I'm only 26. Aren't I too young to get hearing loss? No, Billy. Anyone can develop hearing loss. There are many risk factors that can lead to that. Age is a risk factor because people are always slowly damaging their inner ear but there are others other than that. If you work in a place that has constant loud noise or if you consistently listen to really loud music can both lead to hearing loss. Also, you could be genetically more likely to develop hearing loss if your parents also developed hearing loss young. My dad has really bad hearing. He is only 53 but already needs to use hearing aids. Could that be why I have it? It does make you more likely. Where do you work? Is it a loud place? Um, yeah I guess. I work at an auto repair place working on cars. There is a lot of loud tools and banging on things. Most of the time though I listen to my music with headphones. So that shouldn't have affected me too much. Billy. Didn't you hear what I said about some risk factors? Listening to loud music, especially on headphones, is one of the biggest causes of hearing loss in America today. Oh. I didn't. This is so crazy. I'm too young for this. Of everyone that I work with, why me? Billy, don't be angry about it. It's hard but you're not the only one. The amount of Americans with hearing loss has doubled in the last 30 years. It's estimated that more than 28 million people have some sort of hearing disorder. So you're not the only one. Where do I go from here, Doc? Well, from looking at your risk factors and symptoms I am going to diagnose you with sensory neural hearing loss. This is caused by damage to the tiny hair cells in your inner ear caused by your risk factors along with injury or disease. Specifically for you though, I would say that the environment you are in at work and your genetics are what caused your loss. Okay, so what can I do? Can't we fix it? Well, I have a little bad news for you, Billy. Give it to me straight, Doc. The type of hearing loss you have is not repairable. Unless you sustained some sort of injury that damaged your ear that can be fixed by operation, there isn't anything that can repair the damage. There is some treatment and things you can do to prevent your hearing from getting any worse. First, I'm going to prescribe that you wear hearing aids. Huh? I said that I'm going to prescribe that you start using hearing aids. It will definitely improve your quality of life because your hearing will be much better with them. I also suggest that you wear earplugs at work. Not headphones but earplugs. I would avoid the loud music directly in your ear and other forms of really loud noise. That will ensure that your hearing doesn't get worse than it is. I also want you to come to me yearly and get your hearing tested. I have three different types of tests here that we can do to see if your hearing has gotten worse. Everyone should make sure that they get their hearing tested annually to make sure they are not damaging their ears. So there isn't anything else we can do to fix it? I just need to use hearing aids. I guess I can do that. Well, that's good. It will really help you, Billy. I promise. Sweet. Thanks, Doc. 
I'll go get those right away. Thanks for all your help. Your information really helped me. No problem, Billy. Come back and see me if you need anything else. Bye, Billy. Huh? I just said bye, Billy. Oh, sorry. Bye, Doc.